Hey there, sweeties! Jazzy here, and welcome back to Let's Get Jazzy! After about two weeks of a hiatus, I am sorry. I say that every single time I upload, but I am sorry. It wasn't as long as it was last time, though. That was like a month. Two weeks is nothing. So, I'm an English major, guys. I'm, I'm, like, not trying to come up with excuses, but I kind of have an English report to write every other day. So, I have two weeks left in the semester, and then I am all yours. All yours. I'll get to focus on you. Get that room worked out so you're not just sitting in front of me on my webcam that doesn't even fill up the screen all the way. <sighs> We're not going to get into it. We're not going to get into my complaints. For right now... I'm going to try and make this video as short as humanly possible. I got lots of comics to show you guys this month and some books that I started reading that I love. Before I do, though, remember last month, like, not last month, two weeks ago when I was talking about how I couldn't see Jason Mewes and Kevin Smith because I didn't have tickets? I have tickets now. So not only do I get to meet Kevin Smith, I get to touch Jason Mewes and touch his face, and I'm excited. Okay, I'm creepy, but I'm I'm excited to meet them. It's going to be really funny. I've heard their little show is really amusing and people like it, so I'm glad to have tickets. Now I'm going to stop talking and I'm going to jump into things. First thing on my list of things I got this month. This mug. Now, technically, this is my boyfriend's mug, and I'm just borrowing it for a little bit, but, um, babe, you're not getting this back. I'm just gonna steal it. I've been using it for tea, and it's been fantastic, but, but look at that. Look at Star Wars. Star Wars! Yeah. So, sorry, baby. Next, we have my comic books for this month. I'm sorry I'm so hyper. I'm so happy to be in front of a camera and talking to you guys again. I really genuinely miss all of YouTube. And I'm pumped to be getting back into things. Let's go. First thing that I got this month. Gang of Harleys. Which is a new comic book that just came out. That is Harley Quinn, obviously. But she has a little gang with her. And they're all kind of dressed similarly to her. And they fight crime. And the thing I love about it, from what I read, the art is amazing, much better than the comic book art, because the comic book art is not that good to me. At least when I was reading them, they weren't that good. Maybe they've changed. Like I said, I've been having, like, special editions, so I haven't been able to read a lot of my Harley Quinn covers. But, yeah, so this is really good. I like it because every single one of the people in her gang have a very distinct personality, and they, you can definitely tell the difference between all of them which is hard to do when you have a lot of characters in one book and I think they do very well at that so I'm gonna keep getting that comic book and maybe I don't know if you guys are even interested in this but I can do maybe monthly do some reviews on comic books if that's something you guys want to see write a comment down below say hi see how you doing all that wonderful stuff Next, I have the Poison Ivy book. This is number four. Four out of six. So there's only going to be two more, and it has Poison Ivy and Catwoman on the cover. So, hello. Yes. Uh, speaking of Catwoman, okay, Catwoman, Poison Ivy, and Harley Quinn supposedly have been, it's canon that they are all bisexual, which I think is friggin' great, and I mean, I knew it. But it's nice that they actually, like, came out and said, like, yeah, they're they're bisexual. And Harley Quinn and Poison Ivy are together and in love and all that wonderful stuff. Uh, next, another Poison Ivy. Well, it's not a Poison Ivy book. It's a Batman book, but it has Poison Ivy on the cover. And the thing that makes me laugh about this is, just look at the title, Twin Peaks. Because you know, this is the best of you, am I right? Am I right? But yeah, so I'm not going to open this because it's an older book. As you can tell, I'm not going to open it. But the cover is cool. It's not my favorite, but hey, beggars can be choosers. Next, I talked about this in a comic book news video a really long time ago. It is The Legends of Tomorrow, which might be a play on the DC Legends of Tomorrow comic book. All I know is they have Firestorm and like a bunch of other characters, and I believe it's just a shit ton of like one shots if you can see the girth and thickness of this book. And it's kind of a love story to all of the fans because it's kind of an older firestorm and kind of a modern firestorm all thrown in together to make one firestorm. So I'm pumped. I'm going to read it. But like I said, I'm when I am reading a lot of comic books. 
that and I'm going to school so I'll catch up next is Gwenpool which is another thing I talked about in a video a while back and it is the one where she is a fangirl that went into an alternate reality and all of a sudden she's a superhero haven't read it but from what I've heard it's not that good but I'll read it and like I said I'll review it if you guys want to see it Assassin's Creed number six I have every single one of them I love Assassin's Creed if you guys know I've probably talked about this in a video Assassin's Creed is my all-time flame favorite favorite video game franchise i'm in love i have every single one of the games except for the ones that are on playstation because i have an xbox one and that's we're not gonna we're not getting into it next harley's little black book this is the newest harley's little black book and it has zatanna in it which makes me really happy because zatanna was actually the very first character i cosplayed well officially officially cosplayed as in i i studied her manner as mannerisms and i had the wig and i had the fishnets i had all of that going for me so zatanna has a very special place in my heart i met stephane i believe it's Steph stephen larue stephane larue he was when zatanna had her own little comic book he was the artist and i met him and i was dressed as zatanna and it was fantastic the story for another day but yes next doctor who obviously it has a river song on it you really think i wouldn't get a fucking comic book with river song on it Ch -ch -ch -ch. river song is my goddess well alex kingston is my goddess river song just happens to be an attachment to alex kingston who is my goddess mm, that's it not to talk but yeah so i don't really collect the doctor who comics so i can't tell you how it is but i do know that that one has river song in it and that makes me happy finally harley quinn number 26 i don't have number 25 so i haven't really been keeping up with the story as much as i'd like to be but but this says owned on it because she beat the shit out of joker i don't think you could see it with the glare sorry but she has joker all beat up in mine parts which makes me happy because joker deserved to get his ass beat Next, and I'm going to try and like really shorten this super quick, I read a few books this month that I really genuinely liked and wanted to tell you guys about. So first thing I read, I actually read this for school as a requirement for English, and it's the I Am Malala book, which is an amazing story about this girl's life and how she fought for education. Well, she still fights for education, but she was fighting for education for her village to have equality with women and men and have them all be able to teach and learn and uh she actually got shot because of it if you guys know I, i'm sure you guys know this but you probably haven't read the story or read what led up to that faithful day so this is a book that really puts your life in perspective definitely put mine in perspective i was like man it makes you realize how lucky that we have it and how we take advantage of that but that's another story i'm not gonna get into it next we're on art so i talked about this in my december favorites video about how i had it but i've actually read it this month well not all of it but i started reading it because i was reading peter pan as well but i really like it so far it's a book kind of getting through your creative roadblocks and just nipping procrastination in the butt because let's be real most of us probably have a procrastination problem i know i do and i'm actually in the process of writing a book which I might vlog about sometime soon, but this kind of is making me be like, all right, I need to get off my butt. I need to get some writing done. So hopefully that'll be out before I'm 50 because I've been writing it since I was 11, 21 now. What does that tell you? Next, you guys saw this, the Peter Pan book. Peter Pan, I've always been fascinated with Peter Pan. I always loved the little boy who couldn't grow up and wouldn't grow up. And I actually read the book. So I really like it. It was like five dollars and it has Tinkerbell and I realized that Tinkerbell cusses like a sailor and she's jealous and she's literally me. She's me. So I really like that. The book's pretty it's a pretty easy read. It's more for younger like like younger kids, but they have some older and kind of way of talking. So some words you may not understand unless you get the context of the sentence and if you're a reader you probably do this all the time and I'm just talking to people who know. But yeah, so these books are really cool. And then finally this month, I'm going to just like have it on the screen real quick. I actually got a crap ton of pop vinyls, but these are the 10 that I'm really excited about there. Of course, you guys know it is Pac-Man. 
obviously. So yeah, I have all those, but yes. So that is what that is. And that is all the cool stuff I got this month. Pop final video is going to come up next week, next Wednesday. And it's of the 200 I have, and I'm actually going to record and show you guys all this cool stuff. But yeah, so I'm going to stop talking because this video is getting a little bit longer than I expected. Sorry, but uh, you guys got lots of information and lots of covers today. So yay. Uh, thank you guys so much for being patient with me. Like I said, two weeks and then it's on like Donkey Kong, like for reals. But yeah, so thank you so much for watching. But unfortunately, that's all for this video. But we will always have the next one. See you later.